Alright. I think I'm ready here, Emma. Yes, I believe that I am. I think so. Hi everybody, I'm Mark, and welcome to Smokey Steve and Mark. How's everybody doing? It's great to see you. Yes, it is. Uh, happy Wednesday. Uh, happy Weigh-In Wednesday. I know, Weigh-In Wednesday. I used to dread them, you know. Um, I'm always a little nervous about them, but I don't dread them so much anymore. But, as you can see, Stephen is not with us tonight. He is home. He is okay. He's just sick. Um, he did get sick, you know, I think we talked about it yesterday, he wasn't feeling well, and, uh, he's been unable to hold anything down, although he did eat a bagel today, and it stayed down, so he stayed home from work again today, and he's just been resting all day, I've been trying to take care of him the best I can, so, um, hopefully with a little luck, and some positive energy, he'll be good tomorrow, that's what we're hoping for anyway, so, anyway, Bandit is back to his old self, Thank heavens, because I was, I, I hate when he's not feeling well. He was sneezing and itching and then, um, but, um, he has some medicine to take and he seems to be completely on the mend now. He's playing and everything again. So very happy to report that. I hate when my baby is sick. I hate when my babies are sick. Both of my boys were sick anyway, but I'm feeling well. Thank heavens, um, you know, because I get a little bit worried when everybody in the household is sick. We even have a few people at work who are sick, and I always get a little bit nervous, you know, and I, I just don't want to get sick, you know what I mean? But, um, and then I worry about the medications that I'm on. Um, some of them are immune suppressors, so my doctor uh, has always told me, he, he said, you know, just make, make sure, you know, try not to get sick, and if you do, make sure you take care of yourself, you know? So, like, that's in the back of my mind when everybody is sick in the household, you know, like, I don't want to get it, I don't, but anyway, so, so far, so good with me, I've been taking a lot of vitamins, I've been resting, you know, and, uh, um, so I'm really, really happy about that, so, why don't we get right to weigh in Wednesday, Steve did get on the scale today, so I have his to report, and I have mine to report to, so, for weigh in Wednesday today, last week, I was at 204.1, this week, I'm very happy to announce 201.9. That's about two pounds lost. So I'm really, really happy about that. I have made some changes. I've been eating a little better. And let's see, since last Wednesday, let's see, that would be seven days. Four out of the seven days, I ate actually home cooked food instead of lean cuisines or a frozen meal. So tiny steps. Like I said, this is a journey, you know. Um, I was notorious for eating nothing but frozen meals for dinner, like seven days a week, you know. And uh, so I, I did make that one change, and I, I kind of stuck to it. So I'll, that's really, really good. Um, I've been doing my portion control where I make my dinner tray up, and that's all I eat. I don't overfill it. And I don't get up and go get more food. So what I have on my tray, I eat and that's it. So I've also been exercising more, which I'm, I'm happy to announce too. For whatever reason, I'm very, very grateful for this. Um, my medication, I, I suppose, is working. Um, we had a change in weather uh, today, drastically. It was dark, dingy, and rainy all day. I think they called it a... Uh, some kind of super something, super cell, super vortex, I don't know, something's coming up to the northeast, and we got, we got hit very early in the morning, this morning, we got hit with it, and it's just been constant, non-stop, all day, rainy, cold, dreary, usually when that happens, I kind of seize up a little bit, you know, but, um, I'm happy to report, you know, um, I, I, I feel fine, and as a matter of fact, you know, outside of a few hours in the morning of being very, very stiff, um, this has gone on for, for months now. I've been feeling very, very good. I haven't had any major flare-ups. A handful of days I didn't feel well, um, but, I mean, it's been a long time. So, uh, that's just a little update of my health and where I'm at. Um, I believe the medications are working. I'm super happy about that. I've also learned how to listen to my body and listen to, like, when I need to take a break, when I, I need to stop and rest. Um, and kind of have figured out what my limits are, you know, what I can do, because I was always a person that just would go, 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 you know, 
and I can't really do that anymore. So that's how it all kind of ties into um, our way in Wednesdays. Um, I was able to exercise a little more, and I've actually incorporated free weights into it now, too. Now, granted, I'm at the beginning of it. I mean, I'm doing like 10 reps with free weights, um, but you know what? As time goes on, that will multiply, and hopefully I'll be able to get back into shape again. Uh, for the first time in a long time, actually since I got sick, I'm hopeful for that, and I'm optimistic about it. So I'm super happy to report that to you. Now, Stephen, last week was 186.0. Today he weighed 185.2. So, you know Stephen, he's like, hey, I'm just happy I didn't gain weight. I think it's a success. I'm I'm happy he didn't gain weight too. And actually, if you go by this, he actually lost almost a pound too. So all is well with weigh-in Wednesday here at Smokey Stephen Mark. We both lost a little bit, and we're both still on track with our eating and our exercise and everything. Very happy to report that. If you are doing weigh-in Wednesdays too, I hope you have a great weigh-in Wednesday. I hope you lost. I hope you're working towards your goals and all is going well. I'm sending positive energy your way. Yay! <laughs> but anyway, um, I don't have a lot to talk about today, so I thought we would maybe chit-chat a little bit and say hi, see how you're doing, let you know how we're doing. I already told you about Steven and me. Um, I got a package today from Amazon. I know you can't see what it is, but all of our stuff arrived for um, our Halloween special on Sunday. I'm super stoked about it. As it's getting closer and we're putting all the little segments together, I'm getting excited. I dig those kind of things. Um, but one of our uh, decorating items came, well, a bunch of stuff came today, actually, um, for like our backdrop and things like that. So I'm super excited about that. I'm not going to show you because I don't want to spoil it. This will just be a little teaser. You probably can tell, but whatever, you know. And also... I wanted to um, offer up something. Uh, every once in a while, I try to uh, give back in a way. Um, you know, I like I like to say thank you to everybody who, who watches us and who supports us and everything. And so we try to run contests and, I don't know, we try to give back, you know, whenever we can. And I have a $10 Uber Eats gift card here. It's up for grabs, whoever wants it. Um, let's see, why don't we say the third person to email me at smokystevenmark at yahoo.com. It's yours, all right? So send me an email if you'd like an Uber Eats gift card and it's all yours, all right? So there's that. Uh, what else do I have to talk about? Um, oh yeah, the Halloween, our Halloween special is Sunday, this Sunday evening. Mark your calendars. You want to be there because it's going to be a lot of fun. And that means you still have a few days to get your photos in for our contest. We have a lot of photos. I'm going to post some more on Facebook tomorrow. They're so cool. I love them. And all it is is you just send us a Halloween photo of yourself or your kids or your pets or your decorations uh, to SmokeyStevenMark at Yahoo.com or on Facebook or on Instagram. And we'll put them all into a big cauldron. And we're going to draw the winner live on Sunday during our Halloween special. And the winner of that contest gets a $50 prepaid Visa card. So definitely, definitely, definitely get the photos in. You know how I dig those things, too. I, I don't know. I dig a lot of stuff. Right? Oh, oh, wow. Oh, my goodness. I think it's shout-out time. I'm doing a solo shout-out. I think this is a first. I don't think I've ever done a shout-out by myself. It's just not the same. Well, you know what? Steven's here in spirit, I'm sure. I don't want to wake him up. I should. I should go grab him and bring him in so I can throw confetti on him. But I won't. Anyway, so our shout-out today goes to Leanne in Missoula, Montana. Woo! Oh, it's still fun. Even by myself. Yahoo! Yes! That confetti's for you, Leanne. Anyway, Leanne, thank you so much for being a subscriber and for asking for a shout out. Uh, you are from Missoula, Montana. So I did a little digging because I knew nothing about Missoula, Montana at all. It is a city in western Montana with a population of approximately 75,000 people. It's known for its. Uh, it's known for its blue ribbon trout fishing, which was made famous by the movie A River Runs Through It. I remember that movie. It was set there. That's super cool. 
Uh, Mazzola used to be completely underwater. Um, it sits at the bottom of a valley, and it was covered with over 2,000 feet of water known as glacier, oh, glacier, Glacial, wait, Glacier Lake Mazzola. And uh, it was that way until the burst of a giant ice dam in Idaho happened, which was about 1,500 years ago. That stuff's so cool. I can just imagine it being, well, of course, I think of it as the city now completely being covered with water, but I guess it wasn't like that before. I have confetti in my hair. Uh, all right, uh, at least four ghost towns are within driving distance of Missoula, one of the most famous being Garnet. It's about an hour's drive away. For three bucks, you can go to Garnet and you can tour it, and they still have some of the old, like, buildings from the Wild Wild West, and it's said to be haunted. You can tour it. That is totally right up my alley. I would so love to see one of those old ghost towns. That's one thing I have not been... Uh, to any, like, old Wild West ghost town. That's one thing on my bucket list. I definitely want to do that. And last but not least, you can surf right downtown. Yep, you can. They, they, um, let's see. It, it's a man-made, it was man, it's called Brennan's Wave. And it's, it's man-made, and it's right in the middle of the city. Um, in the otherwise really calm Clark Fork River. That's pretty cool. It draws visitors from miles around. They can come in and surf right in the river. That's super cool. Anyway, just some interesting little facts about Missoula, Montana. And Leanne, today we celebrate you. Woohoo! Thank you again for being such a great subscriber. We really appreciate it. Thank you all of you for watching us. I really, really dig it. Um, and if you'd like a shout out, definitely leave your name and where you're from in the comments below and we'll get you on the list. We pick them randomly and we're good for about one, maybe two a week. These are back-to-back -back shout outs. We did one yesterday too. Um, and on that note, uh, with that contest, uh, well, with our shout out, we always have a contest with the shout out that runs all the time. Once a month, we draw the name of, randomly draw the name of one of our shout outs uh, that happened previously. And that winner gets a homemade gift from me. I make uh, candle uh, holders, and I don't have one to show you, um, but you get the gist of it. It's a homemade candle holder. And uh, so once a month, somebody wins that. And I have something super cool to show you. This is so adorable. Last month's winner was Gilbert and Troy. Um, their channel's called Bonded Together. They're super cool. I, I totally love them. We chat all the time. Um, they made a video of their unboxing of the prize that I sent them, the candle holder. They were the winners of the shout-out contest last month, and they made a video of unboxing it. So I thought it would be so cool to show it to you now. So let me get that ready, okay? All right, let me go get it. Hey there, Smokey Steve and Mark. Hi, guy. We have one. So something came you. in the mail today. <laughs> we thought we'd do an unboxing video for you. Yeah. Here's a knife. Oh, we can fit no that knife. <laughs> I know how to use my knife. Be careful. I know. Vamos a ver. Mi candle. Open the one. <laughs> Professionally yeah. wrapped. Look at this. Or packed, I should say. Yeah, you're kind of saying me. I need lots more. of bubble wrap. Yep. Oh. Oh, and confetti. confetti. We celebrate you. Confetti. See, we pay attention. Confetti. <laughs> and more confetti. Oh. oh. A little card. Yeah, so cute. Smoke and step. Smoke is even more. Hi guys, thank you so much for. Uh, I'm not saying. Watch thank it. you guys so much for watching us. We're ha uh, we were happy. Sorry, we were so happy you won the TV shout out or the the shout out contest. Um, Hope you like the gift. Much love, Mark. Mark, Steven, Bandit. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you very much. 
This is official Smokey Stephen Mark and Sammy. Wow. Oh, a nice little bag. Oh. Isn't that nice? You guys are so sweet. <laughs> Oh, that is so nice. Look at this. This is it. A... Oh. We love burning candles. We have some going right now. <laughs> mm. Mm. Like oh, that's great for fall. Oh, they put it in. Uh huh. Then you can put that inside. Thank you so Thank much. Thank you so much, guys. It's so sweet. We love you, watching your channel, getting to know you. I feel like we know you guys Aww. on a personal level, even though we've never met. <laughs> Thank you very much. We really appreciate it. Thank you, guys. Okay. So nice. We'll think of you every time we burn it. That's really nice. It's time for it. That is so cool. I know. Gilbert's the crafter. <laughs> Wasn't that cute? I, that was, it just made my day when I got that video. It really did. They are, they are two, like, super cool people. I really, really like them. And, uh, and when they said, oh, we got official Smokey Steve and Mark Confetti, I, I don't know. It, it was just really nice. Thank you, Gilbert and Troy, for sending that. I, I really, really, really loved it. Um, and I hope you guys did too. You know what? We'll put the link to their channel down below if you guys want to check them out. Um, their 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 channel is uh, a lot of fun. I, I they go different places and they take it's it's a lot of fun. Check it out if you get a chance. We'll put the link below. Okay. So um, let's see. Did I cover everything I wanted to? Halloween special. Blah blah blah. Yeah, I guess I did. Well, look. Thank you so much for spending your time with me. I really, really appreciate it. Fingers crossed Stephen will be back tomorrow. I think he will be. I think he'll feel better tomorrow. I'm going to do my best to make sure that he feels better tomorrow. Uh, I don't have uh, much of a week. I go back to work tomorrow. And uh, then I'm off Friday. And then I go back to work Saturday. And then Sunday is our Halloween special. So that's all my plans for the week. Um, I hope you're having a great day. I hope you have a great rest of the week. Remember, if you want a $10 Uber Eats gift card, be the third person to email me at our email address, which is also listed below, and get the photos in for our Halloween contest. And I guess that's it. Thank you so much for watching. And um, be sure to check us out on Facebook at Smokey Steve Space and Mark. Be sure to check us out on Instagram at Smokey Steve and Mark. Our email and all our contact information is below. And as always, please like, comment, and subscribe. We'll see you next time. Remember, stay positive, everybody. Ciao.